uh, we've been working with submarines going up underneath the ice and measuring the thickness and so uh, that's that's been the, the important thing that's fed into the the, the, the uh, understanding has been the fact that the ice is only is less than half as thick as it used to be and that that then has all these consequences for increasing the rate of loss so as you say peter the uh, it seems really ludicrous that re- the research you've done is not fed into the people that are uh, making these predictions about ice loss um in the arctic um, i take it um, you're talking about the intergovernmental panel on climate change here um Yes, I mean uh, it is it is fed in in the sense that that people uh, a lot of modelers are now coming up with uh, with model model predictions that do match the data better, right. and uh, so so really they the modelers are many of them are catching up, but uh, IPCC has always been behindhand because of the fact that everything they they do has to be. Uh, at least sort of two years old, uh, so it, it's it's they're always catching up, um, whereas uh, and they're always behindhand. Whereas uh, m- modelers who are trying to match the data are uh, are doing a better job. And and uh, would you be prepared to say whether they are being uh, the IPCC people have any pressure put on them by governments or by corporations at all? Uh, well. They obviously do in the case of the policy makers summary that the mm-hmm. the original IPCC reports are pretty uh, and I, I've been involved in this process that right. that the the reports are are, are are done according to the best science that that, that you you can use mm-hmm. um, but um, there's a policy makers summary which we, where the 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 elements of the basic elements of, of the IPCC prediction results are are put in a simple form um, for policymakers to 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 use as people who, who who sort of plan on things like sea level rise and how much we have to allow yeah. for and so on. Um, but at that stage, the, the production of the policymakers summary, national governments do put their all in because. That, 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 that document goes around uh, all the governments that are in IPCC and each one of them can have an input to, the, to, to what it said so that it's, it's, it's inevitably, well not inevitably, but it is toned down and, um, and certainly processes that could be rather frightening and seriously and serious that we, it's to the extent that we should be dealing with the problem uh, and taking it seriously, get get toned down to the point where it looks as if it's not something we need bother with. And I think one of the one of the examples of that is uh, release of methane from the Arctic mm-hmm. uh, from um, from the Arctic seabed, which most people who've studied that uh, it, it think that this could be a very serious problem for world climate, um, but you won't see that in the IPCC um, policymaker supplement. I'm now accepting the reality of the surreal.